What's up YouTube, Sky that one guy here, and today we are opening up the Big In Collectibles monthly subscription crate from November. I know we're in the middle of December, I'm late on these every single time, but uh, we're finally getting around to it. This is from last month, November 2022. Uh, if you're not familiar with the company, I'm not sponsored, but uh, they sell monthly mystery boxes of Yu-Gi-Oh! products, and they do an amazing job. I've been subscribed to them for years now, definitely love it pulled a lot of great cards from them so this one came a little late in november and then like black friday came cyber monday came and those are my busiest times of the year selling cards so selling and buying i should say because i buy a lot of stuff on those days too and i sell a lot on my ebay and on my tcg players so anyways again november big in collectibles monthly subscription and it looks like we just got a ton of packs this time around which is totally cool by me so we'll keep that kind of right there just so you know what's going on so let's see what packs we got we got our mystery pack save that for last and we got battles of legend crystal revenge oh whoops whoa so four of those two magnificent mavens and two darkwing blasts so look at that variety plus the mystery item imagine you know you you get one of these packages every month at your door. I just sign up for a year and just the whole year every month I'm getting something cool. So this is really cool. I've opened all these products before, but I've never actually opened up any of these packs on the channel. I've never opened Mavens. I've never opened Battles of Le Legend. I've never opened Darkwing Blast. So this will be the first time you see me open any of these packs on the channel. And if you want me to open a full box of any of these sets, let me know. Pick one of these three and I'll order it and open up that next. So if you want me to open Battles of Legends, say so. Or Mavens, I'll buy a box of that. I know it's a different type of set, but I'll buy a you know, display box or Darkwing Blast. So let me know which one you want me to open on the channel, and I'll buy a sealed box of that set and open that up next. So I guess let's start with Battles of Legend. Um, this set, I both like it a lot and I don't like it. I'm nervous that Konami started putting nine, I think it's nine Starlight Rares in one single set. That's kind of diluting, that's kind of over saturating the starlights that's just too many starlights for one set i'm hoping it's just a one-time thing because they decided to fit the full exodia set in here i'm hoping that was the logic behind it and they don't continue with nine starlights per set because that's a lot <laughs> that's a lot and also now it's like guaranteed one starlight per case i don't know if i like that either because then if someone's you know they pull the starlight the rest of the case is just kind of meh and you know it just ruins that chase for me but but we'll see how it plays out. This set is still brand new. So anyways, Toon Harpy Lady. Beautiful card. Originally printed in Toon Chaos. This is its first reprint. It looks great. Gravity Balance. Really cool. Ultra. Okay, G Golem. <clears throat> Dignified Trilathon. Secret Rare. With a Dynabase and a Amazonas Hot Spring. Really cool artwork. Really cool, actually. I like that tiger thing, whatever that is. Awesome. So there's our secret rare. First secret rare. Um, I'm actually going to put these up here because I'm going to run out of room. Okay, Battles of Legend pack. I do really like that they used, they're doing like the Pokemon thing where they got four different wrappers, four different types of pack wrappers. Like Darkwing Blast and, and these sets with just one picture on every pack, it's a little boring. It's really cool to see them have, you know, four different ones in the same set. I really like that. I know Pokemon did that and it's really successful. Like people collect the full artworks. So like if a collector wanted to collect this set, he would have to get four packs instead of just one to get all the artworks of the set. So it's just things like that. It's cool. So uh, Dark Sisada, Blackwing Samoon. That's a really good reprint. These were a little expensive for a while. I'm going to pull the two ultras off the back. Blackwing Full Armor Master to go with our Blackwing Samoon. Then Dimension Dice, and our secret rare is, ooh, the Chaos Creator, nice. Again, this was originally printed in Toon Chaos, and this is its very first reprint since then. Beautiful card in secret rare. And it was a, a decently priced card in Toon Chaos. It was pretty valuable. Okay, pack number three. Toolbox, G Golem Pebble Dog, 
Blackwing Gale, Battle of Sleeping Spirits, and our secret rare, <laughs> G-Golem Invalid Dolmen. So we're getting all the G-Golems in here. All right, so that's three secrets so far. Can we get a last pack magic on the Battles of Legends? Let's see. Okay, here we go. Last pack of Battles of Legends. Blackwing Samoon. I love all the Blackwing reprints, by the way. Crystal Beast and the Crystal Beast. Crystal Beast, Emerald, Emerald Taurus. Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon. Again, another really good reprint. Crystal Skull. And our last secret rare of Battles of Legends. Royal Straight Slasher. All right, pretty cool. So this goes with the King's Knight, Queen's Knight, Jack's Knight. Cool. Okay, so that was Battle of Chaos. And again, if you want me to, if you want me to open a full box of that set, or even if you want me to see me open multiple boxes, let me know down in the comments. Let's get into our two magnificent Mavens packs. This set has collector's rares, beautiful cards. Uh, they're pretty hard to get though, so I don't think we'll get one in two packs. But you never know. Starting off with a Black Luster Soldier and Boy of the Beginning. Man, that's a strong start. BLS. This card used to be really expensive. The original version still is really expensive. Beautiful card. Gosh. That's got to be one of the best looking cards in this set, I'm sure. I could, I could, like, that's a display. Like, I could literally hang that up on the wall or something. That card looks so cool. Okay. Sword Soul of Taya. A G Golem token. We're getting a lot of the G Golems. Aileron and. Oh, I'm still opening these packs like Crystal. I don't know why I'm doing that. Bruru Ignister. Sorry, I don't know why I'm opening up these packs like Battles of Legends. That's funny. Okay, Magnificent Mavens again. I actually don't know if the Collector's Rare would even be in the middle. I don't even know. Ooh, totally awesome. That's one of the better cards in the whole set. Nice. That's a big one. That's huge. Sweet. Witchcrafter Vice Madame. Wow, oh, that artwork is sweet. Look at that. That's a cool card. Okay, Therion Duke Yule. Mizuki, solid reprint. I used to sell commons of this for like four or five bucks, so that was definitely a needed holo reprint. And a multi roll. Sky Striker is very popular. Very good hit there. So, pretty happy with these packs overall. Let's get into our two Darkwing Blasts. <clears throat> okay, I'm not going to name the commons here. We're just going to skip through them. And we got a Blackwing Chinook, the Snow Blast. So we got plenty of Blackwing cards here today. And last pack of the video, then we got this mystery pack thing. Let's see what we get. Darkwing Blast. Cash Tira. Let's see what we get. Here we go. Ooh, Blackwing Fada, the Emblem of Wandering. Man, like I said, this is Blackwing City today. Blackwing, Blackwing. Where'd all my other Blackwings go? I had more. Blackwing Sirocco, Blackwing Gale, Blackwing Samoon, and Full Armor Master. Yeah, this is a lot of Blackwing stuff. Okay, let's see what our mystery item is. Here we go. Feels like maybe a deck of cards, like a Speed Duel deck of cards or something. Not really sure. Doesn't feel like booster packs though, I don't think. Oh man. <laughs> I cut that pretty, pretty poorly. There we go. Okay, and our mystery item. Hey, I called that, so it's like a Speed Duel little starter deck. So if you ever want to play Speed Duel, look at that. You got a whole starter deck there for Speed Duel. Pretty sweet. All right. Power Bond. 
So that was the mystery box from Big In Collectibles for November 2022. Apologies that I am late again on opening these. I always am late on these things. But uh, yeah, really fun to open, really great products. Like I said, I've been subscribed for years to Big In Collectibles. Never had an issue, pulled tons of high-end cards. So there's no funny business going on. They ship out legit packs and uh, yeah. So we're gonna do the, the December one here really soon. So hopefully actually in December on time. Um, but yeah, so hope, hope everybody's having a good day. Hope you're all are, you know, prepping for Christmas. Hopefully not str stressing too much and uh, I hope you're all holidays are awesome. So thank you so much for watching everybody. I really, really appreciate it. Please do subscribe, like the video, it helps a lot. Share with a friend, even just one friend. Click the share button, send it to them. It means a lot to me if you could do that. And uh, finally, check out the eBay store, Brett's Card Shop. Link in the description or Google search Brett's Card Shop. And it should be the top eBay link on Google. So definitely check that out. I got some auctions going right now for some really cool Yu-Gi-Oh cards and playmats. All starting at a dollar bid. So check those out. And that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one.